Oh, oh, if it isn't the princess. A most fortuitous meeting. Yes, yes. Uh. Ah, and her royal highness, Sire Leeds, and his royal highness, the prince. Oh, and I see Kyle is with you, too. <laughs> oh, 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 such a pleasure to run into so many people that I usually don't get a chance to see. Oh, yes, indeed. I, Solemn Burrows, am a very lucky man today, if I do say so myself. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh, my, my, your royal highness, you do sound a tad fatigued, yes. Come to think of it, you and her royal highness, Sialides, just got back from an inspection visit. Did you not, sir? Oh, no wonder you're so exhausted then. <laughs> so, Lord Burrows, why have you graced us with your presence today? What business would bring a man of your stature all the way here? The Senate's in recess, after all. <laughs> a man of my stature? Oh no, oh my, my, you're far too kind. Indeed, though it's true I've been made the head of my faction, I'm little more than a glorified facilitator. And now that the Senate is out of session, I have to run about on little errands attending to trivial details. Uh -huh. Come on, Dad, hurry up. Let me say hello to the princess, too. Ah, uh, you're a mo my, my. Sorry about that, son. Greetings, everyone. I trust you are all well. I am Yorumbaro, son of the great Solombaros. Ah, fair princess, do you remember me, perchance? Uh, yes. We met a few times at the Sun Palace banquets. Oh, princess, you do remember me. My, my, I am truly the happiest man alive. <laughs> And I, too, have never once, no, not for one day, no, not even for one moment, forgotten how you looked. And now, with the elegant object of my affection standing before me, oh, my heart is about to flutter away. Oh, princess, you are like a precious gem in the heavens that someone such as I could never ever hope to reach. Please, if you would just permit me to kiss that ever so lovely hand of yours, I... That's more than enough of that. <gasps> Mia Keys, where'd you come just from? Just in time. The only gentlemen allowed to touch the princess are His Majesty Farad and His Royal Highness the Prince. If you still insist on doing so, you'd better be prepared for the consequences. Consequences? The waters of the Fatus River are really cold, you know. <laughs>